Stories of the Outlands, let's check this out. My girl Lifeline's getting her own thing. Fuck yeah. Now, where's the button? Oh, here we go. Oh. Right y'all. That's right, Lifeline. And I heard she's getting a buff, too. We'll talk about that. Is that a Skyrim? Oh, she's gorgeous. Look at her. Finally, some good old rock and roll. Look at that lifeline go. She's so great. You got this, sweetheart. Oh, no. Huh. It's been four months. This is not coming back. I'm so bored to tell you. Still bored. You forgot. You're my guardian angel. Who's that? See if you're like. Oh. the mother. <laughs> Chase. Only believe in second chances. Not for them. Uh. What's wrong? Nothing. Just join the Frontier Corps to help people. Not to try and doing that. If oh. it worked for you, I'd be dead already. But there are some things you can't change. <laughs> Unless you've got a fresh stash of meds lying around. I'll figure something out. I'll find a way. Huh. Silver Pharmaceuticals, huh? Listen, Silva. I need your help. Ah. Hey, we just saw his face, too. Man, Lifeline's so cute. I love her. I know I'm gonna play her more often. Yeah, Lifeline, who is that guy? No shit. I gotta hang out with them more often. They're rockers. I wonder if that's really her singing. It has to be. really gotta make a show dude look at these come on respawn you guys are rich don't let netflix do it please the only thing they did good was stranger things Chica, 
We should go. Am I any different from my parents? Probably. Oh. Of course you're different from your parents, sweetheart. Yeah, you're doing something pretty scummy, but... Necessary evil. He even runs the same... Oh yeah, his legs. I forgot. No, Doc! Well, fuck yeah, Doc! <laughs> fuck yeah! Was that before he fucked up his legs? Oh shit, it was. Huh. Mm. Why does Life Life's boyfriend look like such a douche? Get these to the other. I've got you. Oh. Fuck! Oh no. Is that a P twenty nineteen? There you are, my darling. Quite a mess you have made. Shit. Stop. You don't want them. You want me. Promise to leave these people alone and I'll come home. Very well. This time you do as you're told. Yes, mother. Go ahead, Captain. Consider this a lesson in Hey! We do whatever it takes. We're here in the midst of a wild hostage situation. Smash that light bulb! Whatever happens next, the whole Outlands will know about it. You're such a disappointment, boy. Let's go. Thanks for the donation, Pops. Quick thinking. The power of social media, huh? Always be a shame. Nothing can change that. You're really gonna dump her ass for that? You don't need that douchebag. You need Octane. You and Octane get together. And fuck all you who say, oh no, they're better off as friends. That's how good relationships start. He was right, you know. You'll always be a shame. When has that ever stopped you? What are we gonna do next time you run out? Whatever it takes. Fuck yeah, I like that. That was one of my favorite ones. That was a beautiful one. I love that. The fucking whole, like, I know it was pop punk, kind of, but it's better than fucking the crap music that they put on this shit anyways. I, I, I'm i pretty hyped for it. The wingsuit looks cool. I'm Good thing I got some uh, coins in the stashed away. I better hurry up and finish that battle pass. So, uh, her, uh, her buff, right? So, apparently that... Apparently, from what I hear from other Apex YouTubers, is that her buff is going to be, uh... The doc is going to have a more wider range of healing instead of being, like, you know, close to this window. You could be probably way over there, right? So some people said that was stupid. But in my honest opinion, it's actually good. Because let's say uh, Lifeline does pick you up and she's throwing the health drone down. And another enemy makes it around. And, and if your Lifeline is good and is a good Lifeline, she'll cover you fire. And, you know, it'll be two against one. So better you getting healed 
while you're shooting and because of that range that it got bigger now you could fucking you know you know fucking uh dodge up and down and shit like that so i think that's a way good good idea for her for uh doc plus instead of 150 health for everybody it goes up to 999 or 9999 which is infinite when it comes to like coding i guess in games so that's a good thing too so if we're ever trapped into the uh trapped in the storms and nobody has health there's doc for you which is good because have you noticed his fucking tactical cooldown is way too long for a single dose of 150 health it's not good and uh from what i hear the care package you're gonna get it three minutes and like a couple seconds later earlier than five minutes which is kind of lame in some ways so they say her buff is not good it doesn't sound good to be honest it doesn't sound too good to be honest it sounds better but it doesn't sound too good honestly i wish they just brought back her old kit give her back the shield you know give her back the shield give her back all this and you know what too actually her ultimate if they're gonna change her ultimate they might as well i don't know i think if you're gonna have her ultimate drop it should it should at least have more healables you know what i mean like it should have more more things at least one body shield one section of med kits syringes and one side shield batteries shield cells it should have four and two batteries and two med you know what i'm saying like it should have that have it give us more give us more options and shit you know at least that's what i think or nah never mind that'd be too strong huh what if she had a care package where it works like a uh it works like a fucking uh what do you call it the uh material the the crafter you know what if it works like, like that right but nah, i don't think it'll work that way plus in serious situations you wouldn't have time to be doing that so it wouldn't make a lot of sense they pretty much should just give her back her old kit as I said, if you suck at the game that bad, you can't get around the shield, then... Pfft, terrible. Because, I mean, come on. Like, if you had her shield up... Just compare it to fucking... What's his name? Compare it to fucking you guys. We already went over this. You guys already know. But I like the story of the Outlands. I uh, can't wait for the town takeover. I know they're doing one for Lifeline, and it's going to be great. I'm into that. Let me know what you guys think. 